I can't see the bananas. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> ah. Best went to the moon. Best can't the see the bananas. Is backfiring. <laughs> no, I'm in the back. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> That's just flopping around. Let's can't see! Hello, hello, hello everyone. I hope everyone is good. Chloe is odd, bear photographer. Thanks for the look as well. Gabbing about. Good to see you. I have got your DM, my friend, Gabbing. I will reply to that hopefully tomorrow, my friend. Uh, but, 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 but I'm late. Yeah, get over it. <laughs> IRL happens. IRL happens. What can I say? Max Brimble, did I say hello to you? I can't remember. Wookie, hello. So we press the beard button. I am late, but you know, I'm sure you'll get over it. Uh... Let's press a beat button, let's go. Beard, 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 how are we doing? Hope everyone is good. Uh, what's going on here? Why are you being a tit? PC, please. Please. PC. Here we go. We're good. We're good. We're good! Oh, did we punch the microphone again? For God's sakes. That bloody panel has come loose again. My panels need sorting out. Thankfully, most of the panels are the ones you can't see over here. But I need to get this one sorted, man. This is getting on my nerves. <laughs> Johnny, I've got some awesome news. I'm not sure if you got my message. Uh, my GoFundMe page is out under Whalemar Jail and Bait Charity Event. Amazing. I I saw something, but I didn't get to it. I've been quite busy today, unfortunately, Max. But Max, by all means, post the link here. Post the link here, and we will uh, we will promote your charity event, my friend. Um, God damn it, this bloody panel. Get on my nerves, man. Going. Uh, it'll do. It'll do. Yeah, yeah. Show, send us the uh, link, uh, Max. There it is. Uh, let me go and pin that for a bit. I'm not going to promise to pin it for the whole stream, but let's pin it for a little bit, my friend. Um. Um. If you can spare a few pounds. Support our friend Max, who is doing the Weld Bar Jail and Bail Charity event. Hey, Melanie! I've had a good weekend, lovely. How are you? How are things with you? Uh, let me just go and... So that's in... Uh, weld my hospice care, yeah? Hospice care. Right, copy and paste that. If you guys want to donate to Max's uh, charity event, please, please consider to do so. He's raised £250 so far. That is incredible, dude. GG's to you. Um, he is stuck in prison, I'm afraid, until he hits his target. So please help him out. Uh, he's a good egg. 
we're just gonna pin that. So yeah, if you guys wanna support a charity event today, please consider helping out Max Primble. There we go, Christy 7 with the taking names. If anyone else wants me to take their name, let me know. I've got Chloe Izzard, best photographer, gabbing about Max Brimble, Cyberstar Wookie, and now Chrissy. Double O, double seven in the book. You're most welcome, Max. You're most welcome. Um, there we go. Everyone is in the book. You've got about 15 minutes if you want me to put your name in the book. Yeah, sorry I'm slightly late. I had a, We had a, a friend come over. Um, me and Sue had a friend come over. Um, first time I've seen them in about 18 months, and they had some very exciting news. So... We were um, we were having a good time with them, and then we ordered takeout, and then takeout arrived fucking late. So it was like, for God's sakes, hurry up! I've got streaming to do. <laughs> the people need me. <laughs> I'm joking, obviously. Um, so um, yeah, you made the book. You just made the list. I need to put that as a sound alert. You know what happens? You know what happens? Uh, oh my god, I can't type with my fat fabs. Cool. Yeah. Alright. Be like that then. How am I? I'm okay. I haven't done my channel. I'm really not prepared for today's stream, am I? Clearly. I'm okay, thank you. Yeah, how are you, Chloe? How is Mama Chloe doing as well? Um, yeah, I'm pretty good. I've had an alright day today. Today at work was fine. And then, I had, as I said, we had some good friend, uh, good news from a friend today, so that was really nice. Um, and then I had takeout, so yeah, so today's been pretty good. Cannot complain. Cannot complain. Look at our schedule, guys. Look at it. Oh, in all its majesty. Look at this week's schedule. Uh, we are going to be playing some Resident Evil 1 Remake very shortly. We played through Chris's campaign, finished that last week. We started Jill's campaign. We are going to be playing through Jill's campaign. Um, by the way, all both campaigns were playing on hard mode. Uh, we've played through Chris hard mode last week. First time playing uh, RE1 Remake on hard mode. And it's, it's hard. For me. For me. Um, I'm not the best at this game. Uh, comparatively with some of the other resis. Um, so, um, yeah. But it's um, yeah, it's, it's been fun. Been a nice, fun, chill uh, set of playthroughs, Resident Evil 1 Remake. Um, we will be playing Resident Evil 1 OG once we finish Resident Evil 1 Remake. Uh, we will be learning no damage. I'm quite nervous for that. I've never, never attempted a no damage run before uh, on any Resident Evil. And I think RE1 OG will be slightly easier. I might be wrong. Um, so we will see. But anyway, that's that's in a few weeks' time. We'll be finishing Jill's campaign. I suspect we're going to finish Jill's campaign next Monday. I'm your Huckleberry. Gotham, how you doing, man? Why, Johnny? Beard. You look like somebody just walked over your grave. Gotham, bitch tits, how are you? Uh, Mama Chloe's doing fine. She can't wait for the quiet weekend when I'm in knots. <laughs> I bet. I bet. We're gonna be having. We're gonna have to be looking after. You. No, I'm joking. You look after yourself. Uh, can't wait to meet you. Um, you sat down for dinner, so I'm happy. Hell yeah! What are you eating? I pulled a muscle today in my abs. Oof. Was it like a pull a stitch, Max? Oof. Painful. Um, looking forward to the charity event. I, I know I shouldn't say I'm looking forward to going to prison. Exactly. You shouldn't be saying that, but you did. <laughs> Doing a stupid update thing for a friend. Kind of annoyed with Facebook, by the way. You saw your post on my Facebook. Yeah, yeah, I did, Gotham. You know what? In fact, that same friend that uh, I saw today for the first time in 18 months, I invited them to the same thing, and they also said the same thing. It's fucking annoying, man. Uh, Facebook events. I used to do, back in the day, I used to do, like, my birthday events on Facebook and shit. And then the pandemic happened, and then I haven't done anything since. So then, like today, so for my birthday this year, I was like, "Oh, let's do a little Facebook event thing," and um, and it, no one's fucking seen it, which is really annoying. But Monday down, but Monday down, rest of the week to go. Yes, agree, agreed, agreed. And I, uh, I can't wait to see your opinion on my deep dive into the Resident Evil remake uh, video that I will be doing. I'm, I'm, I'm not, not there yet. I need to finish the final part. 
and literally the last two hours of Resident Evil Remake to go. <sighs> Rebirth, even. Um, and I, I, I knew if I watched it yesterday, I was going to have opinions. And I, I didn't have not have time today. So tomorrow, I'm going to be um, watching the finale of Resident Evil Remake. Um, and then I'm going to be, hopefully, if I get the time, doing the video tomorrow. Um, I don't know if I'll upload it tomorrow, but we'll uh, hopefully I'll, I'll record it. So I've got a lot to say. I've got a lot to say. I mean, I will thumbs down as a joke. Please don't thumbs down as a joke. I got a lot of thumbs down on the last one. <laughs> I need all the thumbs ups I can get. <laughs> I know I'll get haters. I know I'll get haters. I just hope we can go at one of them. I told you my thoughts because I know. Uh, I told you my thoughts because you know it rubbed people the wrong way. But you know what? In the end, bro. In the end. In the end, there's a lot of good in Rebirth, and there's a lot of stuff that is dubious, in my opinion. But you know what? I knew it was going to be like that. It's kind of been as I thought, if not in terms of a game, much better. Like it's 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 really good. Like let's get that out of the way. Like Final Fantasy VII Rebirth is fucking incredible. <laughs> it's it, it's. It's the best Final Fantasy game in 20 years. <laughs> Let's get that out of the way, straight away. Yeah, the, regardless of your opinion on the storyline aspect and the changes, the actual game is incredible. <laughs> I'll say no more. Uh, there's a large number of people who think like you do with Rebirth. Yeah, yeah, I know there is. I know there's a small minority. It used to be a 50-50, but then as time's gone on, people have kind of been like, ah, I'm, I'm not mad at the I'm not mad at the changes. And I'm like, really? You were mad at the changes a few years ago, and now you've changed your tune. I've stuck to my guns. But okay. I'm the I'm 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 the unpopular one, fine. <laughs> I don't care. It's my opinion. I haven't changed it. Um Chadley needs to shut the fuck up. I think that's one thing we can all agree with. <laughs> Johnny's beard is looking awesome as usual. Oh, hell yeah. Thank you, Max. Thank you. Um, so, yeah, anyway, back to the schedule. So, Resident Evil 1 Remake, we're continuing that today. And we hopefully will finish it next Monday. If not, it'll be the Monday after. Um, and, uh, ooh, Akia. Hi, hey, Akia, how you doing, man? Good to see you. Good to see you. I hope you're well. Um... What was I going to say? Uh, Wednesday, guys. I cannot wait. You know what? I've been thinking about this a lot today. I've been thinking about how much I'm so excited to play the Spire Reignited Trilogy. Um, it's been about... When did the Spire Reignited Trilogy come out? It was 2018, 2019? Like here's in the book. Um, whatever it was. Anyway, I've not played Spyro since then. I've not played a Spyro game since then. Um, and I've not played a Spyro game on this channel in six years. It's been a long time since I played Spyro, and I'm looking forward as heck to playing the whole trilogy on this channel uh, in its HD remaster format. Um, so that's something I'm really looking forward to doing on Wednesdays with you guys. Uh, it's been a long time coming. I've been wanting to play Spyro on the channel for a long time. Um, so that's going to be good. I'm hoping that we'll um, have a good time with that. I hope you guys are looking forward to that as well. I, I know the game is relatively well. Spyro 1, I know pretty damn well. Spyro 2, I know well enough. Spyro 3, I know pretty well. So of the three, of the trilogy, Spyro 3 is the one I'm most comfortable with. Um, but yeah, um, looking forward to that. Uh, first time I officially watched Spyro was Insomnia. Really? I had no idea what the guy was doing, but I had a lot of people catching flies. <laughs> Well, we're not going to be speed running or doing anything like that. We're going to be just doing a casual playthrough. I'm hoping to 100% it times three. Um, I'm hoping to platinum it actually. Um, there's a platinum it on my PS4, but not on my Xbox on my uh, Steam. So this will be fun. This will be fun. Uh, I've never act you've never been into Spyro. But it didn't appeal to me back then. Really? I would have thought you'd have been a, a Spyro guy, Gotham. I don't know why. Call me. Uh, call me wrong on that obviously uh, i genuinely thought you were you would have been a spyro guy knife only run tonight uh, i'll think about it i'll think about it um so sea of stars we're gonna be playing that on friday i am still loving sea of stars if you guys have been joining me for that series thank you because it's not a popular series on this channel but for me i'm fucking loving it and for the ones that are st sticking around with it 
I think they're enjoying watching it, so thank you. Um, so we'll be continuing more of that on Friday. Um, it's been fun. Sunday! Sunday, this was a surprise. I did not see this coming. Uh, I was surprised to see the winner of the Retro Sundays poll yesterday being Sylvester and Twitty and KG Capers. You bastard! All right. Is it still Elijah Woods? No, no, that was a different Spyro game. I've never been into Spyro. Oh, sorry. You've said that already. Apologies, I missed, I read that twice. Um, yeah, no, no, the Elijah Woods one was on the PS2. So this is the remaster of the PS1 trilogy. Um, yeah, uh, so we're playing Sylvester and tweeting KG Capers on Sunday. So for those who don't know what that is, that is basically a very janky platformer that came out on the Mega Drive or the Genesis. Uh, obviously featuring Sylvester and Tweety from the Looney Tunes. Um, and even though it's not the best platformer ever made, it still holds a really close place in my heart. And I've got the game downstairs. Actually, I might bring the game up, actually, for you guys to see it um, on Sunday. Um, it's a fun, janky Mega Drive platformer. And um, yeah, it's. I think, I think it's going to be fun to play that. I've never beaten it. I've never finished it. It's quite hard because it's a bit janky. Um, and um, I think I've got about halfway through the game, but I've never actually beat it. So we'll probably save state our way through it if we get through some difficulty. Uh, but it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. You learn something new every day. Elijah Wood and plays Spyro. He did. He plays Spyro in the... Uh, what's it called? There was the re it was the reboot on Spyro, wasn't it? Um... A new adventure, or something like that, was called. It was. It was not. Oh Christ! There was the, the the. There we go. The Legend of Spyro trilogy. There you go. Wookie's got it. Yeah, Elijah Wood was in that. Um, he's been in gaming studio managers and indie studio. Does he? That's kind of heckin' cool, man. The one that Sparks can talk. Sparks can talk in the third one a little bit. Then again, does he talk? Talk in the Legend of Spyro? I don't. I've never played Legend of Spyro. I've never played it. Um, but he does in um, in the <laughs> in the third Spyro game. Um, so yeah. Um, and then the final announcement on the schedule, guys, is the Final Fantasy Tribute Special. I'm going to show you guys, if you don't mind, the trailer that we just dropped today for um, the Final Fantasy Tribute. Um, so let me just, uh, pause this. Uh, okay, so we, um, announced the next episode of the podcast today. Well, I didn't announce it. We announced the streamers taking part in the next episode of the podcast today. Let me go, uh, flip over to this. Oh, that's not good, is it? Oh, that's all janked up, isn't it? Uh, so, for those who don't know, I have a podcast called Streamer Stories. We feature streamers talking about games they played as a kid, growing up, their all-time favourite games, and uh, how it somehow led them to become the streamers that they are today. Episode 9 of every season is a special episode where we do something slightly different. And episode 9 of season 6 is this episode. And we feature not one, not two, but three different fantastic streamers. Um, and this trailer will tell you more. Here we go. It's only 21 seconds. There we go. That was quite easy to, to, to follow that, I think, wasn't it? <laughs> so, yeah. Streamer Stories Final Fantasy Special is this Sunday. It is a Streamer Stories um, episode that's been, oh, God, 12, 18 months possibly in the making. I've been trying my fucking hardest to make sure that 
if I was to ever do a Final Fantasy edition of my podcast, I would only speak to top quality, high, highly respected streamers in the Final Fantasy circle uh, to join me. And to get the stars to align was a lot of work. And we got it. We got it. We, we, we got that lightning in a bottle moment. It was a few weeks ago. And we spoke to three brilliant streamers you all should be following if you're massive final fantasy fans uh and they are in order we have eyes on b who is just final fantasy streamer royalty as far as i'm concerned luna wait hold on no luna look where the dog i bet is. it was gotham luna are you, are you wait, happy with the trilogy with the, with the three no, people i that's chose why you're... i thought you were being cute you're just trying to eat the pop tart on the desk what the heck <sighs> uh, so Eyes on B uh, is, as far as I'm concerned, one of the best Final Fantasy streamers of all time. Absolutely wonderful human being. Someone we've had on a podcast before as well. In fact, we've had all three of these people on the podcast before. Um, and uh, on the award-winning podcast, thank you. Thank you, Wookie. Uh, Eyes on B is the one I don't know. Really? Gotham, you need to be checking out Eyes on B, man. You're missing out. Eyes on B is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful person. Um, yeah, Eyes on B is a hugely well-respected member uh, um, um, person in the Final Fantasy community. Uh, has been for a long time. Uh, it's a fantastic streamer, wonderful person. And then, of course, we've got Neon Genesis, another fantastic legend in the Final Fantasy community. Someone else we've also featured on the Mash. podcast. Huge. Final Fantasy VII speedrunner. Final Fantasy VII remake speedrunner as well. Uh... Whoa! Holy shit, he did it! Boy! Wow. I can't fucking do that. <laughs> so Neon Genesis is a, again, Final Fantasy, VII, Final Fantasy royalty. Final Fantasy VII royalty. Uh, absolute wonderful, wonderful human being as well. Um, yeah, a, a huge name in the, the British Final Fantasy scene. Uh, and a great person. Yo, Megan, how you doing? And then we have Kuraga, another awesome bean. Absolutely lovely, lovely bean. Uh, one of the most wholesome people I know. <laughs> I know. I don't remember ordering anything tiny. <laughs> Just with that hat was fantastic oh, then. Oh, <laughs> right. Of course. It's the little An absolute sweetheart that, uh, a, a neon is Kuraga. But Pezzo is going to send me. Ha <laughs> ha. The little neon Genesis pin. Yay! Yes, also one of one of uh, one of is. neon's mods. <laughs> well, it's backwards <laughs> as well. But, you know, because camera is mirrored. Uh, so yeah, Kiraga again, massive RPG streamer, uh, plays a lot of Final Fantasy, loves a lot of Final Fantasy. Again, also featured individually on the podcast. All three of those people that I've just shouted out have their own episodes of the podcast on the podcast. Check them all out individually if you're wanting a preview into this Sunday's episode, which is the Final Fantasy tribute. And as I said before, I'll say it again if you missed it, this episode is the longest, the biggest episode of the podcast we've ever done, as far as I'm concerned. We've never had a bigger episode than this. Uh, it is nearly an hour and a half long. It's about an hour and 28 minutes. <laughs> we just couldn't shut up about Final Fantasy, okay? Trying to contain ourselves was so hard. It could have easily have been a three-hour podcast, four-hour podcast. We could have Bullshit. kept going. Um, it was just so magical. Uh, just hearing their stories, talking different opinions, different you know, um, different uh, points of which people started their journey in Final Fantasy and stuff like that. That you know, their favorite moments, playing the games, streaming the games, everything in between. Honestly, it was one of my favorite things I've ever done on 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 the podcast. It was so so good. So if you guys want to check out that very exclusive episode of this podcast, check it out Sunday 6 p.m. BST. It drops on YouTube and on Spotify. And again, uh yo D Mac as well, how you doing? I hope you're good, Megan. I'm very well, thanks, lovely. Um yeah, if you guys want to check that out, uh, please do. If you guys want to watch it, uh, then obviously then um, there's a video accompanying it in terms of some uh, some classic moments from all the games. Um, but if you want to listen to it, it's on Spotify. In fact, if you're not first, I'd actually kind of recommend you listen to it because, pardon me, uh, because my, my Spotify is this close to being monetized. So if I'm being, if I'm being selfish, 
I actually want you to listen to it. <laughs> but if you want to watch it on YouTube, that's totally a okay by me. Um, so yeah, that's dropping on um, Sunday, 6 p.m. BST. So yeah, there you go. And with that, there's going to be an ad break coming up in about a minute or so. So we'll have a little quick chat. And then we'll chat for the ads, and then we'll play some Resident Evil Remake. Does that sound good? Cool. What if I unfollow and then listen to it? Why would you do that? <laughs> yeah, so good to see you, Megan. How was your weekend been? How was, how was your... Uh, you, had a, you had a really good stream yesterday, I think, DMAC, didn't you, baby? I'm sorry I missed it, but I, 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 I saw uh, you had a really good spontaneous stream. What were you playing? Oh, my God. I got a really annoying issue nose. I'm so sorry. Because it's me. <laughs> I'd rather you didn't unfollow, but you know, <laughs> I, can't, I can't control you. Um, so yeah, hopefully Gotham, uh, you you approve. You hopefully you approve. I think this <laughs> part of me, part of me, Gotham thinks you thought I was going to get someone else on that podcast episode. I don't want to mention oh names. My <laughs> God, Becky, look at his beard. It's just so. Beard. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate the follows. Part of me feels like Gotham was expecting someone else's name to pop up on that podcast episode. And hey, if they accepted, I would have been up for that. But unfortunately, no, that person is not um, easily available, shall I say. Um, it's all good. It was a spontaneous one. I had an itch to try and complete Kingdom Hearts 1, which I failed, but it got near to the end. So I got to suffer through a long end world sequence. Oh, God. I, I genuinely, genuinely don't know if I could stream Kingdom Hearts. Like, that game stresses the fuck out of me. It's a really good game, but I, I feel like I would rage playing it, and I don't like raging on stream. I try to avoid that if I can. So, I do want to play the Kingdom Hearts um, games uh, offline at some point, when I, and I can rage offline, then can I? You know what I mean? There's an advert hitting now, guys, if you're not subscribed. We'll be back in a minute. I think we will need a good long chat about Final Fantasy considering I am someone who has played them all. I have my snob glasses on. Well, maybe we could have a chat about it at some point. I fuck Kingdom Hearts. It's a good game, but there's so much to do in it. Oh, man. It is a really good game. It's... it's. I find, I find it really hard. I'm not very good at Kingdom Hearts. Um, I've got to be honest. I... I, I find it quite infuriating <laughs> in terms of its difficulty but it's actually a very good game and because i've not finished the first one i've not played the second one i don't know if i need to play the first one to play the second one but because i never finished it i never did ever pick up the second one which i've heard is like the best it's one of the best games of all time isn't it game had series is kind of stupid in some of the games whereas in some of the bosses get armor and you have to trigger some bullshit really Right, okay. Do I play this music or do we... Nah, fuck it. We're going to go flip over to Resident Evil 1 Remake, guys. So that ad break's going to finish in about 10 seconds. Um, boo -doo -doo -doo. Sorry. I got all these uh, pop-ups now. I've changed my settings on Steam. Right, okay, so we're going to play some Resident Evil 1 Remake. So we fin as, as, if, you, if you've just joined us and you missed the start of the stream or if you've not been following for the last few weeks, we finished Chris's campaign um, last week. We started Jill's campaign, and we're going to continue through that. Now, we are playing these games on a hard mode for the first time ever, um, which is kind of cool. You're powering through the first one so you can get to two. A friend of of mine claims two is the best. I've heard two is the best. I've heard two is... Yeah, I've heard two is the best. Do you need to beat the first one? I, if I, I feel like you need to keep on top of Kingdom Hearts lore to understand what the fuck is going on. So, it's another reason why I've not played the second one. Do you need to play the first one to understand the second? D kind of knows that the second one is the best one. I'm not surprised. Yeah, they all link. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they definitely all link. But, like, do you have to? I don't think the guy who created Kingdom Hearts and Star Wars going on. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think you're right. Um... Okay, so we are playing as Jill on hard mode. Not really to kind of tell you. Oh, do they? Okay, that's interesting to know. 
Right, okay, so we just got the sword key. That's where we're at. We've got the chemical as well. Uh, we haven't got the lighter yet, have we? So we'll go upstairs. We haven't got the armor key yet, have we? No. So the plan is to use the sword key. I did the Kingdom Hearts Remasters 1.5, 2.5. You can play in order if you want. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Are you yawning, sir? Okay, that's armor. Okay, armoire. Oh, sir. Do you mind? Oh, that went fine. That went pretty spiggity doo. Hey, Danny. Hello, lovely. You've been overlooked. <gasps> what? What? Oh. Oh, did I, oh my god, I'm so sorry, I, I didn't see- oh! <laughs> There you go, I took that- I took that bite for you, Daddy. That was for you. That's an apology. <laughs> I didn't even see that, I'm so sorry. That was for Danny. <laughs> I didn't see- I genuinely didn't see your messages, Lovely. How are you doing? Oh, here's the dog whistle. Bullshit. All right. I'm sorry. Is that the lighter there? Oh, that's in a different place. That's weird. Well, should we maybe reset so I don't take that bite? Or should we take the bite like a man? And, uh, or like a Jill. And, um, and move on. Get off my Jill, you cunty McCunta son! <laughs> Hi, F. Mead. How you doing? You are super tired, but entertained by you just entertained the family and it's been such a busy day. Oh god, that's tiring. That is tiring. Bless you. That's not easy. Um Right, okay, I'm gonna put those back. Uh I I'm so annoyed that I took that chompy chomp. Uh, am I on danger or caution? I'm on caution. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll stay as is. I don't know if I want to use this lighter. Or do I want to use this lighter? Mm. I'm going to regret this, but fuck it. You're peopled out. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you. Hosting is not... Door, Did you see it? On the left side of the door frame, barely visible on camera, a white translucent mystery slowly creeps into frame. As a So, what do you think? I think I know who that was. Azure Dragoon, I think that was you. No! Oh, yeah, twat. <sighs> Might as well take this guy out as well, shouldn't I? Oh, is he not dead, is he? Surely. He's dead? Really? Really? Fair enough. You keep changing your name. <laughs> Dragoon, how are you doing? Great to see you. Thanks for the biddies if it was you. I'm pretty sure it was. <laughs> Honestly, it's overplayed now. Well, I I thought I think I felt like that for a while, but uh, people keep playing it. So 
<laughs> I mean, <laughs> what can I say? I mean, I feel like I feel like there's like a, a, a two people play it a lot, and then then two more people play it a lot, and then two more people play it a lot. It feels like it just uh, keeps going. <laughs> Yo, the cannon! You missed your far roommate's door. Ha! Ah. Oh, what what can possibly top it, Wookie? I honestly don't know. I don't know if there's anything else that would be anything like Farm Roommate's Door. I fucking hope there's not as well. <laughs> no, I think it was Azure Dragoon that uh, used it this time. How are you doing? Also, hey. Anything with shitting would be a step up. Oh, oh so we're not going from farting anymore. We're just going to straight up shitting now, are we? <laughs> Um, but yeah, hope everyone had a good weekend. Hope everyone's uh, had a had a hopefully a good Monday, if not a bearable Monday. Hopefully it hasn't been too strenuous. The Mac has a shit fetish. Oh, the cats are fighting. I once dated a girl with a twin. People asked me how I could tell them apart. Lisa painted her fingernails purple, and Bob had a cock. Very. Jill, got any good news? Thank you, Asia. Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. no. Can't say it's much safer here either. <laughs> Brute first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then. Let's. Let's try to find hey, it first, Look shall we? What? A can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. Yellow and mellow. It's yours. Oh, cheers, Hopefully babe. You won't have to use it. I got some acid shells. What about you? Oh, don't worry. I like the buddy system we have. Wait! Babe, wait! Babe, wait! Babe! Babe, wait! Babe! Babe! Ciao. Babe! Babe, wait! Babe, no! Babe, no! Babe, no! Babe! We all know Barry just wants Jill's back door. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's a lot from your side, isn't it? Yeah. Don't do it! Oh, God, I'm no. I'm a virgin! <laughs> no, don't do it! What? No! No! I sure no! No, no, don't do Why did you do it? Why did you do it? No! No, why? What? Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard, Johnny Beard. Hello. Hello. It's the Fart Trio. You're all Irish and you're all farting as well. Is that. I don't know if that's a coincidence. <laughs> Oh, I'm fine. Okay. Get off. No, get off. Fight it is then, oh no. Yo, Scar, how you doing? Oh my... You serious? How did I die? Fuck's sakes. No, Decana, no. I just realized what you were talking about. No! <laughs> oh no. I thought you said you were bored of it. 
Oh, oh, oh no, D Cannon. The record has been way bigger than that now. The, the record is. Is it 20? or Is it 20 or 21? I think it's 20. <laughs> I get so traumatic thinking about that. I can't believe I died there, man. That's fucking bullshit. Right, okay. Um. Yeah, I'll do. It's not 21, surely. God. Mass Mark's rookie and Chloe. Uh, <laughs> rookie and Chloe played it all at once. It's been a crazy busy at work today. It'll be mostly lurking. Just wanted to show my support. Oh, evil. Thank you. I hope, I hope you're good. I do hope you're good, my friend. Sloppy. <laughs> that was pretty good, Simon. <laughs> It was something like 12 and 30 minutes, it was, yeah. A crumpled memo. Ooh, I do want that, but I also want the lighter. Lighter! I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I am going to shoot the Zombo. There's no point, is there? Hmm. Ah, fuck it. Thank you for the luck, Wookie. Thanks everyone for being here. Oh my god, so I just realized people are messages, messaging us on YouTube. Hello, sorry, YouTube. I rarely get messages on YouTube, so I... Oh, yeah, cock. Johnny, did you find the... Oh, jeez. Give me a second, YouTube. Johnny, did you, did you find a Ched Wungus Easter egg in the first save room? No, I haven't. This comment is about shooting blood from your chack. Hello, guys. <laughs> He's just walking through the fire like it's... Ooh. Sorry about that. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Not the YouTube peeps. <laughs> What's shooting blood from your chack? Do I want to know? Do I want to know what your chack is? Uh... Yeah, how have things been, Danny? Otherwise, how's your stream? It's been lovely. I was doing a bit of a lurkies over at yours the other day when you were playing the Raider of the Tombs. Tomb Raider! Right, okay. Let's try not to die this time, eh? Let's try. Okay, right, we're gonna... Thanks, Gotham. Oh, fuck's sake. Did we rapture actually? You've had a good time. How about yours? Yeah. Pretty, pretty decent. Pretty decent. Oh, jeez. Oh, what the dog? What's happened there? The dog has died. No! <sighs> Fuck's sakes. Gonna have to come back for you. No! Oh my god, god, bro. Oh, what? Why why couldn't you discard it when you Now I've got a space for it. 
I got a whole freezer full of popsicles. <laughs> Where do you find these on the <laughs> sounds of you? <laughs> Where do you find them? Okay, right. There's a switch. Well, you press it. A coin. There's nothing unusual about this coin. Okay, right. Now we go. I don't think there's anything else in that area apart from the herbs, right? <laughs> Oh, we got our first um, thingy now, haven't we? I knew that guy was still alive. Oh, what? Fuck. <sighs> Thing is, this other guy's gonna go up anyway, right? This guy always gets up. So there's not really any point. Wouldn't mind having a herb next to him, though. Finds peace in death, eh? Oh, shit. The walls came again. Thank you very much. You can still die to this uh, thing, by the way. If you if you um, run into that, if you let it come a bit closer to you, and then you run into it, you can actually die. <laughs> All the residents are here are evil. Definitely, definitely the Irish trio of D Cannon, D Mac, and Cybernetic Wookie who keep farting on my roommate's door ASG. How are you doing? Right. We've got the armor key. We've got the armor key. Ah. It's the Trumpy Trio. That's what. Hey! Hey! That works! That works! The Trumpy Trio! <laughs> Oh, oh shit, fart on my roommate's door, ha. Did you see it? On the left side of the door frame, barely visible on camera, a white translucent mist slowly creeps into frame. As it oh, damn. So, what do you think? Thanks. Hey, SGF, I thought better of you. I thought you were a better person than that. I, I, you know, you know when you think really highly of someone, and then they do something stupid. You know, you know that, that uh, that's that's uh, that's kind of where we're at right now. Bend over, you must. For I must bust a nut. Ready? Okay, here we go. Fucking hell. As you tricking, where do you find these, man? <laughs> right. Johnny. Johnny. Johnny! Take cannon, please. But farting is funny, though. I mean, yeah. It is. 
How are you, Mrs. Boothroy, by the way? I haven't said hello to you. How are you doing? Oh, no. Oh, what? What? How was a zombie breaking through that door, bro? Oh, my God. How many chunks did you take from me? Oh, and there's one on the stairs as well. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck's sake. Ah. Toxic waste. Ah. <laughs> uh, yellow, orange, or green ASG. It's great playing some uh, Left 4 Dead with ASG on the weekend vendors. Who's on his way to 100 followers? I think. Death to the non believers. Our redeemed high pitched voice of wisdom for those music video requests. Queen! This might be my last green, actually. I'm running low on toxic waste. Yes, it is. I'm going to spice some more. This is uh, Kiwi. Hi, I'm new here. Hi. Oh my god, guys, the bot. Mrs. Boothroy, can you deal with that bot, please? <laughs> Yay, you hit 100! Yay! Uh. <laughs> god, that's so tangy! Ugh! Ugh. Oh. It's not a bot. Is it not a bot? Oh, hey there, Nightbree. Are you new here? Oh. Does it need to be made VIP? No. <laughs> nah. I haven't got enough VIP slots, to be honest. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's great. Cool, cool, cool. I don't, I don't, I don't care. I want the lighter. Thank you. Okay. Um. Right. Yeah, I need to get some more um, toxic waste. Have a drink. Right, okay. That's so annoying. Right, let's put these two zombos on top of each other and flame them both. No? What do you mean, no? These zombies are lit. Did I only get one of them? Did I only get one of them? What? Why? Boom, boom. I always forget I can U turn in this game. I did as well. That's fucking bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. Nobody buy an emulation handheld lunch for help. Fucking wasted two hours on this evening just updating this shit. Oh god. 
Has, ha, take that, possible crimson heads. It's getting hot in here, so burn all the zombos. I'm gonna burn the zombros. Love it. Oh. Right. Shit! No! I want the acid round, you bitch! Oh. Oh my god. I'm so. You know what? This happened with Chris you as well. Bastard! This happened with Chris as well. I'm just so shit at the beginning of this game. Once I get into a groove, I'm fine. But the beginning of beginning of uh, the beginnings of these games, I find really hard on hard mode. On normal difficulty, it's fine. Um, but I just um, I just kind of find it hard just to kind of get into some kind of groove with it. Um. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, I'm lacking an emperor to help me with the groove. Right, let's try this again. So far, I've been 100% in my success rate of blowing this particular zombie's head off. Hopefully, it'll continue. That lightning shot was banging. <laughs> That was that was a really good uh, timed lightning shot. Right. Okay. I don't want peace. I want problems always. You don't want peace. Okay. Right. Let's try this one more time. I definitely want to get those acid rounds, so we need to make sure we've got enough uh, space for one. What type of dog is this? <laughs> oh, that was fucking lucky. Oh, no. What kind of dog is this? Oh, okay. Sling bean! This came up in my Steam that you were playing Tekken 8. <laughs> oh, sling bean. Okay, they're both dealt with. Can I grab my knife back? No, you can't. This is not Resi 2 Remake. God. Wrong remake, bro. Oh, I've got enough room now. Um. Right, okay. Let's try this again. My little pussy. My little pussy. What about? What about my little pussy? <laughs> Sorry. Right. Okay. Um. Right then. What about us? Right, I'm gonna, before I do all this. Oh, I haven't got any thingy left. Uh, 
I probably should clear that corridor, to be honest with you. Alright, before we use this dog whistle, I just want to scout this area and lock the other door. I don't think there's anything over here, is there? No. Okay, we've done that now. Just in case we want to go back that way. What kind of dog is this? Nice. No, get off you prick. Oh no, I don't I gotta do this again, haven't I? Gotta do this again. I hate the fact that it gives you the choice. I think it's just in case you actually don't kill the dog. So I am on caution. I might as well. Right, okay, let's go. Hopefully, not die here. Ugh. You bastard. <sighs> Jesus, bro. You got some problems. Oh, he's another, another flamey boy over there. Right then. Okay, good. Uh, well... I'll there's, there's no um, fuel can uh, thingy here, is there? Um, no point in having that yet either. So what have we got here? Have we got any ammo in cribbins? I don't know. I barely checked, didn't I? Um. Okay, right, what have we got here then? Is there any equipment here? No, just a one. Fuck's sakes. I would mind wouldn't mind some increments, bro. But then again, we have just faffed our way through this section. Should I just save anyway? Might as well. Just to make sure we don't have to do all of that again. So I've got the armor key though, I need to remember to do that. Yeah, I know about the bed, but I wonder and when yeah, thank you. To make actual progress, guys. Let's save. Because <laughs> I've been streaming for about half an hour doing the same shit again, like I did like weeks ago. Okay. Um, right. I'm pretty sure we've got some more ink ribbons coming up anyway. Nothing here, is there? Smells faintly unpleasant. Ugh. Here's a lock pick. Okay, we got a broken shotgun here, which we don't need. We got a, a battery pack. Nice. We don't need that because we've already got the shotgun now, so that's good. I had a feeling we were going to get some increments. Something's in my ass. Mm. I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> I 
I'm, I'm, I'm lost for words about it. <laughs> what the hell, man? <laughs> Some things in my ass. Yeah. That guy's just like, just hanging around. Right, let's go and fill this tank. Let's go. Oh, what? No! Oh, he's going upstairs. Hang on, should I try and put this body on fire? Oh, I haven't got a lighter. Oh. Never mind. I didn't know it was a bloody armor door key. That's annoying. Well, you know what I'm going to do? Well, since I haven't got the thing. We're going to use the, um, the chem thing twice. Sorry, the um, kerosene thing twice. Please, don't come back alive. Oh, fucking old Jill. Now, I'm going to reset the room. Because him on the stairs is a lot less dangerous than him not on the stairs. Hey! I thought he was on the stairs, but never mind. Right, okay. Where are you, sir? Here you are. No? What do you mean? That's two more zombies done. Where has he gone? Just running circles around him. Let's refill, then drop it off. Then drop it like it's hot. I know I'm wasting a bit of time doing all this stuff, but it's making the area a bit clearer long term, right? Especially needs and I now need to go back. I do, I do want to, um, I do want to drop it off, it's fine, let's go and drop it off. Right, okay, let's go and drop this shit off. Okay, let's go get the armor key again. Sorry, my phone just lit up on its own. A bit weird. Did I get a notification or something? Ah, shit, what are you doing there? Can't do that, it's cheating. For this door, shit. I want to go for the other door. Oh, for that exact reason. Whatever, it's done now. What's this? Oh, it's locked from your side, that's fine. Right, 
Okay. That corridor is just bad news now. Okay. Now, we've done this again. Hopefully we can actually make some progress this time, though. I'll be examining this. I hope this is not Chris's key. Okay. Okay. When there's a a herby herby herb over here, which is good. It's good. There's now that crimson head over there has gone away. Although he's not gone away. He's gone away. He's over here. Oh. It's quite usual having the mirrors in that room, isn't it? Remain as confused as I was before, as you. <laughs> Thank you for the biddies, though. You are very kind with the biddies. Too generous, in fact. Be -do 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 -do. I might need to do. I might need to clip. I might might need to make get my own version of some things in my ass, though. I quite like that one. Some things in my ass. Right, we're gonna go for this door now. Just so we can get the grenade launcher. The easier bridge is hilarious. Oh, shit. Something caused Forrest's death. Right, is there anything in this room now? No. There's literally no point in going in that corner as far as I'm aware. I thought that the grenade launcher was in that corner. In Jill's game, but no, it's by Forest. So why would you go in that corner? Unless, of course, you, you don't know that there's nothing in the corner, which is obviously fair enough. Okay, we have a grenade launcher. We have acid rounds with it. I'm gonna go this way. Unless there is a zombie in here. I don't think there is! There is! Fuck's sake. <laughs> you bastard! Okay, so that should stop him now from trying to come through this door, right? Surely. Was this annoying? Yeah. And then we've just got the one zombie in this area and he's on the stairs, right? And he should try to vom on me and fail. Thank you very much. 
It was right on cue. <laughs> Blah! <laughs> Right, I need that bad boy. I'm gonna put. Uh, should I? Yeah, I'm gonna put this away for now. Then again. Let's put other things away. So I'm gonna need some space. Do, 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 Thank you everyone that's been lurking today. As always, appreciate you all. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Now we're starting to finally make a little bit of progress. Only slightly. Only slightly. and saved in a little bit of time so I want to make sure I definitely get this right so oh it's the red one we want isn't it oh god I'm going to regret this I I think it's the red one Yes. Phew. <laughs> Au revoir. God, I remember seeing that creep, that thing for the first time, man, and being like, what the fuck? As in, in the original game. It was so, like, holy crapoli, man. Look at that thing. There's no red herbs here. What the hell? Why? Well, it is what it is. Oh, no, no, no. We have our first death mask. Let's go. One down, three to go. You bastards. Let's put these herbs away and the mask away. And recuperate our items. He's like, oh shit, I went up the stairs. No. <laughs> She's over there. <laughs> Welcome to the cum zone. Only come inside anime girls. Quivering clit, double jointed pussy, fresh balls. Welcome to the cum zone. He's just giving up now in life, that guy, isn't he? Oh, well, he's dead, so he's a zombie, so it makes sense. <clears throat> Fresh balls. Oh, yeah. Hi there. How you doing, mate? You all right? Cool.
Anything else here? No. Right, okay. Oh, I got it. Itchy tasty. Itchy tasty, baby. Oh, no. You bastard. That was not worth the two shots, bro. <laughs> yeah, that was not worth the two shots. I don't care about the liquor. <laughs> no, ooh, liquor, okay. <laughs> oh, I thought this guy was here. He's in an annoying place as well. What? Why do you take one shot? Toasty of a guy though. Although I've got to be honest with you, this is impact me. It's like I don't even know if I need to come back down this corridor again. Oh, I probably should, just to be safe. I'm back, what did I miss? I died a couple of times. Uh and we made slightly more progress. Your phone got connected without internet. Oh no. Oh, pardon me. No, uh, let's put that back. For now, um, that. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. What's with these homies? This is my girl. Yeah, I look forward to playing some Spyro on Wednesday, guys. I really am. I'm so excited to play Spyro again. It's such a good game. Underrated, I think. It's crazy to think Spyro's underrated, but I do legitimately think Spyro's underrated. I am I am Team Crash. Always have been, always will be, but I fucking love Spyro. Why can't I use this? Oh, it's not the light, it's the... What the fuck? So I'm just resetting the room. Why? Thank you. Oh my god, that was such a palaver. Right. There we go. That is now done. Oh, we got a fucking zombie over here as well. Take it. Yeah, this game does hit differently uh, on hard mode. I must say, actually, most Resident Evil games hit differently on hard mode. I think, um, RE2 is not as hard on hard mode. Uh, the OG does. Ooh.
Shotgun shells? Are you serious, bro? No, actually, I like shotgun shells. Shotguns are very useful in this game because of the Crimson Heads, so... Fresh balls. This has got fresh balls in my face and in my head all, all the time now, sorry. Can't stop thinking about them fresh balls. Wow, what a mansion. I don't think we've got the music score, have we? Is it easier in... in I don't know if... Um, I don't know if we need it in Jill's game. In the OG you don't, do you? Oh, well, it doesn't make any difference anyway. I've got no fucking room. Okay, right, well, that's that then. Right, okay. Uh, so... Might as well. Can I make it to that other door without that zombie getting to me in time? If I can, then this is the quickest way to a safe room, right? Nope. No, I can't. Bastard. Can I from this door? Let's try. Comfortable at all. Okay. <laughs> I just about, I can't believe I cleared that. I can't believe I cleared it. Right, okay. Let's put the lighter back again. Shall we save again? I think saving might be a good idea. Just to definitely solidify our position in this area. Okay. Just to definitely confirm that we don't need to come back here and do all that shit again. That zombie is just like, ah, oh, just leave her alone. <laughs> this zombie on your hand is a pain in the ass. I got a feeling he's going to come through this door at some point. That's the type of thing he'd do. Is he a spiteful fucker? Right, okay. Uh, is this enough? Do I have to reset? Has someone moved the, the, the bookcase back? They have as well. Someone's walked in and gone, someone's moved my bookcase. So is this without the inside or not? I know with Chris it's separate. I think with Jill it's not. Yeah, you do need the inside. Okay, right. Just so I know. I think I need that lighter again now, don't I? Oh, fuck's sakes. Okay, no problem. Well, whilst I'm down here, let's continue down in here. I don't think there's a lot here, but just to have a little peek. Oh, okay, well, that's that's something. Right, 
Right, there's normally a thing here, isn't there? A small key. Not this time. Is there anything over here? I actually don't think there's anything here. This guy's on the floor, right? Yeah, yeah, and there's nothing here, is there? So there's nothing to do here. With Jill. I thought there might be like a knife or something. But as in like a, a stabby dagger knife thing. Nope, there's legitimately no reason to be here. We're just going to bring the zombie in here for no reason. Can I say, I've never found this cutscene scary. Jill falls on her ass again. She falls on her ass about four times in this game. So there's legitimately no need to be here. Well, at least we discarded a key item anyway. Right, what are we doing now? I think we need a lighter back, don't we? Uh, we need to use the armor key and a few doors. So Johnny, I'm head to bed. I can kind of keep my eyes open. Oh, Danny, that's okay. Please take care of yourself. Have a lovely sleep. Much love. A crutch for Chloe as well. Um, yeah, have a good night, Danny. Much love to you. You take care of yourself. Everyone, go and check out Devilish Danny, by the way. On the road to a thousand followers. Well deserved. Lovely person. Great streamer. Oh, we've already done here. Of course we did. This is the first thing we did. It's not pointing going down the score then, is it? Oh my god. This chair is clickety clackety. Okay, I'm trying to think. No, there's no need to do anything else here. So... That's a helmet key, right? We just saw that before. There's a couple of armor door keys here. The good news is this corridor should be pretty clear. Oh, we got the Richard section, haven't we? Um. Okay, let's do this death mask first. Get it out of the way. Johnny! 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 Oh, Johnny! Oh! 4D, you got me, you bastard. How you doing? Welcome in. Um, trying to think. Do I do the Richard part first? I need to get the lighter. And the serum, obviously. No, let's do this section first and then the richer section. <laughs> I'm good. I'm alright, thanks. How are you? You alright? Coming in here, trumping away. I always forget which order it is. Down. I always forget the last two. Oh, I got it. I got it. Way. Let's go. That was kind of half a guess. How was your weekend? I had quite a nice weekend. I had quite a nice weekend. It was quite straightforward. Did some streamy poos. 
and did some catching up on other editing bits and pieces. He was starting. To, I'm going to be making some small changes to the channel in May, so I'm starting to prepare for those, which has been quite nice. Uh, so that's been good. It appears as if you failed. I forgot what I was doing, to be honest. Sun and the moon. Sunshine will awaken to me. Okay, so it's just a suit of these two, isn't it? That one and that one, right? There we go. You want me to do that, do you? You want me to do that noise? All right. Ooh, woo! There you go. <laughs> okay, let's go and meet Dick. I mean, Richard. We're trying to save our dick. Richard! What happened? You're wounded. Well, you have a wounded this dick. Whole place is a killing zone. Uh, there are monsters. Uh, uh, what did this to you? A big snake. And it had to be poisonous. Ouch. Richard, hold on. Bring me serum. I saw some, but you didn't bring any. I'll go and get it, okay? You're gonna make it. Thanks. There is a serum. Oh no, I forgot to bring some with me. Right, we should be able to get past this area without the um, crimson head once or twice, right? 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 Let's find out. Surely once at least. Yeah, once. Oops. Dirty bastard. Dirty bastard. Okay, right, so that can go. I think I need the lighter, don't I? Oh, I need the actual serum as well, bro. Go on. There we go. You want 4D gaming in the naughty corner? <laughs> Poor 4D. Sorry, 4D Gaming. You're going in the naughty corner um, for 69 seconds, baby. There you go. Get in the naughty corner. Poor 4D. Poor 4D. Did you deserve it? You need to expand your naughty corner personnel. <laughs> this time it's personnel. Oh, what am I doing?
It's only 69 seconds. It's not a long time. It's a good time, but it's not a long time. <laughs> First person I saw was in Chloe. Tie on your sex tape. What a bastard. Does it ever not hurt? I think 4D gaming should be back now. Oh, hang on. Let's wait a second here. Turn the lights on. Look what you're doing now, Wookie. You got rid of 4D gaming. Lodging a complaint for bullying. Thank you, pal. There we go. Yeah. Let me talk to you. Right, sir. Leave him with his candlelit dinner on his own. Do 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 do. Richard. Anyway, gonna go BRB Richard, we're gonna play some Moonlight Sonata. Or should I uh, put some items back first? Uh, let's put some. Uh, let's dump some items and shit. Yeah. Oh, we've still not been down this corridor yet, actually. Let's, let's dump some shit. Isn't there a zombie here? Yeah, I thought as much. I think 4D's mad at me. <laughs> I hope not. Green herb here. That's a helmet thing there. Um, a 
I thought I wasn't sure there was another item in there, but nope, just the one. 4D, come back! Dun, 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 dun. Babe, wait. Okay, right. Let's put the lighter away for now. And the fuel. Wow! Not the wow monster. Um. Uh oh, right. got got respectful amount of health now. In fact, we're doing quite well for for everything really actually. It just needs to not make silly mistakes. Which is easier said than done, right? When you're Johnny Beard. Okay. But yeah, I do. Uh, yeah, Resident Evil 1 Remake. You know what? The more I play Resident Evil 1 Remake, the more I actually think the first one's better, you know? It's nothing against this game. This game is sublime. It's so good. But I don't know. I just feel like I prefer Resident Evil 1 OG more. <laughs> I don't know. It's really weird. It was definitely 69 seconds. Ooh, that might be janky then. Even said 69, didn't it? Yeah, 69 seconds. I don't know. I know this is a better I think this is a better game, but I just think I got a soft spot for the first one more. Jill. Barry, I didn't mean to get you that excited. Right. Anyway, you should read this. Did you just give him a little tickle? Hello, hello. What do you make of it? Well, I guess we were right about this mansion being quite unnatural. You have a way with understatements. Yeah, I mean, this game obviously What's graphically is better. Out? The pacing well, of the game is better. It's a more expanded game. The voice acting is much better. I'm not saying that's not a better game. I think unbiased. But I think just me and my soft spot. I just think the first one. I just prefer the first one. I think maybe it's supposed to play it a lot more as well. I love the cheesy acting of the first one, and I love the fact that the first of it, it was the first of its kind. Like, you know, the grandfather, I mean, it's not the grandfather of survival horror, it's more the, um, yeah, the grandfather of survival horror is lone in the dark, really, isn't it? I've been watching you. Always watching, yeah. Grand uh, Lauren likes the granddad of survival horror. Oh, I haven't got the hook. I haven't got room for the fucking hook. I can put one back though, can't I? Where's the hook? the hook.
Now it just works, right? Hey! Oh no, a bee! Don't fall on your ass again, Jill, please. Hey. I got the wind crest. The crest is a bit of a windy boy. Do, 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 do. Straight through the bed, eh? There's uh, an ink ribbon. What's this? A green herby herb. Boom. You know, I think I will use the green herb. Okay, cool, Leo. Right, okay, time to now play the Moonlight Sonata. It's the Moonlight Sonata. I will go to the save room first and save, actually. So I've got a lot of saves now. Oh, yeah, I'm just chilling on this back. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Okay. Okie dokie. Yeah, we're doing good now, guys. We're doing good. I knew as soon as we got, we broke through the, 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 the awkward beginning, we'd be fine. It's been like that with both uh, Chris and Jill. It's been a really awkward, tense start where you have very little ammo, you have very little health, and you got to try and take some risks by dodging certain zombies or whatever. And then you fuck it up and you die. But once you can start to get some ways around the, the beginning, it opens up so nicely. That's where we're at now. The same thing happened with, with, with Chris, but the thing is Jill's campaign is even easier than Chris's, so... But on easy mode and normal mode, this game is a lot easier. Okay. Do 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 I got room for it, haven't I? Yeah. Did we burn that body? I think I'm glad we did. I think it would have been a crimson head by now. This zombie that was in this corridor. There we go.
Ok. Yeah, again, when I first played this game back in the day, as in the original, not the remake, I used to think that, like, if you were stuck here... That's just a diary, isn't it? Yeah. Um... Yeah, uh, that if you were stuck in here, like, zombies would break through, like, that glass. Uh, it's funny how, um, your mind works when you're, when you're a young kid or whatever. Your fears and shit. So it's it's through the head and the breast, isn't it? It's quite flipping both the way around. see a snicket snicket snake. Anyone want to see a snicket snake? Yeah, snicket 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 snake. It's a Go get some herby herbs. I wonder why the snake's called yawn. I've never actually understood, apart from the fact that you to yawn you have a big mouth. Like I get that, but other than that, I don't understand why it's called yawn. Never understood why the snake's called yawn. Oh, we get to... Oh, hang on a second here. Chloe, did you just call me a bastard? I want the shotgun, so...
No. <laughs> oh, the snake's a bastard. That's fine. No. Nom nom. Oh, he's, you're back for more? No! Shit, 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 shit. Uh. Bye! Serum. Oh, I gotta get my own serum? What? That's bullshit. Oh, there's a zombie here now. Serum. Barry doesn't get our serum. Bullshit. Right. Is he now going to be a crimson head? Yes! Shit! Oh no! Oh, oh shit, he's still not alive. He's still not dead. Heal, heal, JB, heal. Heal, he's getting back up. I was going to say, you know what, I will use the normal shotgun on him actually. There we go. Now he's dead, dead, right? Yeah, good. Bro, you might need to get something, you know, you might need to see a doctor about that, that vomiting thing, you know? Uh, it's got it's got it's got something going on there. Careful. Uh. No. Right, okay. We have been serumed. Okay, so. Um. Trying to think. Can you use these now? I don't know where to go. Oh yeah, I know where to go. Boom. I can take care of this guy. Fucking hell, I took his arm off. Jesus. 
I was just leaving a dramatic pause to make you paranoid. <laughs> it did work. We were all worried. Oh god, where do we go? Adam me. Boom, ba boom, boom, ba boom. Okay, now we shall go down this corridor. I mean, probably should go down the other corridor. Actually, yes, I will. I will. Because if I go down this corridor, there's dogs in this corridor, and then a load of zombies smash through the uh, windows as well. So, whereas in this corridor, we've dealt with all the zombies in it, so. Why trigger new enemies? Oh, you bastard. Help us up. Help us up. Help us up. Actually gave me a shock. Not the how bizarre that zombie breaking through that door. How bizarre? How bizarre? It looks like the knob is about to fall apart, guys. We don't want the knob falling apart. We don't want the knob falling off. Actually, before I do this, let's take out that zombo. Cool. Only one shot left. Should I take out this? I think there's a dog here, isn't there? Ah, oh, fuck it. No. Um, that's orange. No, we don't want that. We want red. Those green, red, orange. Yeah, that's right. No! Ah, shit! I got it wrong. I'm sorry, birds. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, birdies. I'm sorry. Don't hurt me. No more. I know what I gotta do now. There's the middle one. But the middle one needs to be purple. You stupid dumbass JB. Right, so this one. Stay it goes orange. Oh no 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 no. That one you leave it. This one goes Oh no, that one goes green, right? And then this one goes purple. Now it's right. There we go.
Did I ever really deal with these guys? I don't remember dealing with those guys. Do what now? Eyes. This one has no nothing. He's got no nothing, I said. That is one of my favourite screenshots in the whole game. It's so good, that one. This one has no nose. He's got he got his nose. I'm taking a risk here, and I'm stupid, but fuck it. Got one shotgun. One shotgun shell. And fifteen bullets. Nah, fuck it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not doing it. We're doing really well. I'm doing really well. Stand by a push squingish. Oh, oh, I shouldn't be saying it. There's a redeem for that. Right, okay. Uh... Let's go this way. Wasting. Oh, there's a zombie here, isn't there? You toe wet. Thank you, Wookie. Forty gaming. Sanvair push gungish goger churendropus santisilio go go go. Sanvair push gungish goger churendropus santisilio go go go. There we go. I got his head one way or the other. Love me some head. And by push wing is go get a quen drop or sun to sell your cock cock cock. Oh, it didn't. Oh, How can I forget go go go? It's a bit everyone knows. Right, so we don't need that shotgun anymore. We don't need no shotgun like that when we got this bad boy. I'm gonna get that bad boy. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, I'm gonna save again. Second time I didn't know I did. Do 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 do. Let's have a normal heal. Not normal heal. A uh, full heal. Yeah, honestly, guys, thanks for being here today. Appreciate you all. Hope you guys are enjoying the stream. We're definitely smashing through it a lot better now, a lot quicker now. That being said, I'm still not going through it as quickly as I uh, thought I would. Mainly because we took half an hour to actually start getting to grips with what, you know, playing on hard mode. What's up, Skilling? Hello, how you doing? Great to see you. How are things, my friend? Happy Monday. It is still Monday where you are. 
Right, let's go. Let's deal with the Elder Crimson Head. And that's his name, isn't it? He's Elder Crimson Head, isn't he? He's in his like coffin, like fucking hell, hurry up, please, Jill. Jesus. Left me hanging. Have you played Elisa? I think you'd love it. I haven't, no. I've heard really good things about it. It's on my list, Skilling. Ah. That was kind of a piece of piss. I got an achievement for that as well. The Elder Crimson Head. Yeah, I've heard really good things about Elisa. I've not seen virtually any playthrough of it. I've seen like some screenshots of it. Uh and I, I'm kind of happy about that because it looks really good, and I've heard really good things about it. It's um, I believe uh, my streamer friend Tango Mushi highly rates it, um, which is a uh, yeah, I value her opinion very highly on on horror games. So I should check that. Out. I do want to check it out. I think it's on Steam as well, isn't it? It's basically OG Resident Evil 1 with different bosses and enemies. Okay. OG Resident Evil 1 or Remake? Because I thought it looks more like Remake. Like this. Like this. But I don't know. What do I know? Nothing. A battery, eh? And a first aid. If I would have known. Got this again. I always forget this fucking puzzle. Right, is this one? They need to be facing. Oh, I think that's wrong, isn't it? I think that might be alright. Your G graphics aren't like the modern, there's old school and there's tank controls. Barry? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely want to play it though, Skilling, anyway. What's your favourite Resident Evil, Skilling? Stay away from the summoner. Sorry, it's the wrong game. You're a bad man. I think this one's north, isn't it? Yay! I'm quite happy with that. That's not a bad little guess, that. Is crows. Rawr. Rawr. Ah. Zanakin. Zanakin with the raid. 
bear with. Yo, Zanakin, how you doing? What were you up to today? That's how we'll find out. Alan Wake 2, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh. So I'm just getting Welsh word of the day for a cybernetic wookie. Um, welcome in everyone though. I am Johnny Beard if you don't know who I am. I'm a variety streamer from North Wales. And we are playing Resident Evil 1 Remake. Uh, <laughs> Let me just get Welsh word of the day. Welsh word of the day. It's technically two words in Welsh but it means one word in English. It's Tibach. Which is your toilet. Your little, your little house. <laughs> your, uh, your tea bar. Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to uh, the little house. <laughs> or you can say toilet. Toilet is also fine. Um, anyway, yeah, Zanakin, how was your stream, my friend? Great to see you. Yeah, I'm a variety streamer from North Wales in the UK. I am a member of the Nightbreed alongside our wonderful friend Zanakin. Uh, for you to get a feel of what we're playing at the moment, we're playing Resident Evil 1 Remake right now. We are play, playing on hard mode. We finished Chris's campaign. We're now playing through Jill's campaign, both on hard mode. We've just, get, we've just got uh, to the guardhouse Lisa Trevor section on uh, the game uh, with Jill now. Um, but yeah, I'm also playing other games at the moment, like Spyro the Reignited Trilogy. We're playing that on Wednesday. We haven't started that yet. That's going to be a first starting of that on Wednesday coming. Uh, we're also playing Sea of Stars, which is a fantastic indie RPG. Um, on Sunday, Retro Sundays, we're playing a Sega Mega Drive uh, game called Sylvester and Tweety and KG Capers. So if any Looney Tunes fans out there, you might want to check that out. I also have a podcast, um, and we uh, talk to different streamers on it about different things. Um, and we have a, a very special episode of the podcast this Sunday when we're uh, playing massive tribute to the Final Fantasy series. So, welcome in everywhere, Thomas Crapper. Yeah, t t yeah, Thomas Crapper is is, uh, is also likes using the t bar. That's for sure. Um, sorry, Skinning, you were saying, um, I say to you, oh sorry, uh, favorite Resident Evil OGRE three and Code Veronica. Oh, nice. Ooh, I, I prefer Code Veronica to RE3, OG. Um, but um, yeah, I do think I do think OG RE3 is, is also fantastic as well. Um, Johnny, there he is. Yo, Zao, take my name. I can't take your name. You're too late. You're too late. Wookie, what are you doing? Wookie, Wookie, no, don't, don't, don't. You, I hate it when you're doing stuff like this. Anyway. Zanakin, thank you for the raid, my friend. Thank you so, so much. Everyone, please check out Zanakin, a lovely guy, great friend. Uh, please, please check him out. Um, and thanks for, the, thanks for the raid. You didn't say what? Didn't say what? I did. Say what? I've done Welsh word of the day. What are you talking about now? I said to Bach, like three or four times. What are you talking about? Hey, you Sue. Uh, right, let's go and play more RE3. RE3? RE1? RE1. Oh, shit! Oh, the award-winning podcast. Oh, I see. Oh, shit. I need to grab it, don't I? Oh, shit. I haven't got any room. Oh, shit. I'm also... Lucky! <laughs> you gonna go, Steeps? I don't think I'm going to be too much longer myself. Probably about half an hour. 45 minutes, maybe. Maybe. You can barely see those. Two vertical lines, cross, three horizontal lines. Normal alarm, yes please. Oh yeah, Max! 
For me, Ari Frieda's next the biggest nemesis generally scared me, made that game very memorable for me. That makes perfect sense. I I totally get that. And they're still not in danger yet. Yeah, I my mine's RE2. RE2 and RE4. But I do love RE3 and, and Code Veronica as well. We've got the Magumum. Nice. I'm gonna mag your mum with the magnet, baby. These are very aggressive verbs. Very, very aggressive verbs. Why RE2? RE2 was my first um, that I properly played. I thought it was a massive step up from RE1. Scared the shit out of me when I was a kid. I think it still plays best. I just love playing RE2. I speedrun it once if I feel like it. <laughs> um, um, I love the Leone, Claire B, Claire A, Leon B campaign system. I love Ada. Um, yeah, I just... Oh, yeah. I also think the remake is very, very good. It's my favourite remake as well. RE2 is the bestest of them all. I think so as well. You don't have the points. You haven't got the points. Did you see it? Scared the shit out of you. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry about that, boo. <laughs> Ooh. Sorry about that, boo. I forgot you were one of them. I ain't got no clue, darling. You're a bastard, Wookie. Sorry about that, babe. Uh. Oh, hang on a second. What am I doing? There we go. My items are in spickety span order. Well, shit. Best line ever. What, you bastard? Or, sorry about that, babe. What about, don't you worry, girly? Have you, have you seen the kendo mod, Skelly? <laughs> Ow. Thought she was going to hit me a second time then. Not Trev. I'm sorry, Trev. I got spanked. <laughs> it sucks to be you, sir. What's going on in this town? Yeah, seen one mod. It's hilarious. It's literally all just nemesis. Oh, have you, have you seen the Kendo mod? The Kendo mod, which is that you... Uh, the Kendo mod tells you what happens if Kendo survives. <laughs> it's, 
<laughs> oh god, the, the Kendo mod. I, I wish I could erase my memory and play the Kendo mod. Annoyingly, I wasn't really dabbing much in Inari 2 mods at that point. Um, I wish, I wish I could go back in time. If you guys haven't played or seen the Kendo mod. Oh, it's so funny. It's, it's the funniest mod I've ever, I've ever seen. It's so funny. It's so stupid. That um, there's two, there's two, uh, skilling, there's two Kendo mods. Played the, this, the, but the two different stories, and they kind of follow each other. Uh, so play the normal Kendo mod first. Or, or watch it. Watch it. Watch it on YouTube if you want. Jill to Brad, can you hear me? Shit, it's broken. Shit. Woof, woof, woof. Woofy McWoof, woof. Cybernetic Woofy. I was lived that you were a bottom fan. I was fortunate to see him live. Oh, really? That's so cool. I I wish I could have seen bottom. Yeah, I would love to have seen bottom. I've never seen. I've not seen Rick May alive, unfortunately. Obviously, and uh, A. Edmondson. Mrs. Booth, you'd be lurky. I was going to say, I was waiting for someone to make a comment on that. I thought you were going to say that I am not a bottom. And that I'm a bottom fan. <laughs> I'm not a bottom fan. I'm a top. <laughs> Wouldn't dare. You insinuated. Um, I was cooking in in the hot heat, in the hot hot heat, the hot hot heat. That's a band. Uh, a band that had some bangers actually. Are you a hot hot heat band uh, fan, Mrs. Booth? I can imagine you being into hot hot heat. Aid Edmondson, being in the Star Wars movie, yeah. Aid's bio has been my favorite read so far of the year. Oh. I am the great mighty poo, and I'm going to throw my shit at you. Wow. Buckets in a rope, eh? Sounds not so kinky, but I'm making it sound like it is, but it's not. Do, 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 do. Who's playing Conquer? Just reinstalled Resident Evil 4 Remaster today. I guess you've inspired me. Me? I barely talked about RA4. Unless you mean from a conversation we had a, a, a bit ago. I've not played Bo Conquer's Bad Fur Day. It's on my list. I didn't know until yesterday that Conquer was connected to the Diddy Kong Donkey Kong uh, universe. I had no idea. I I had no idea. Do 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 do. Toasty. Toasty. When I was younger, I used to when I when I was younger, I used to think he said whoopsie. 
I didn't think he used to say toasty. Anyone else? Or was that just me? Oh, music's gone. Yeah, I thought it was whoopsie too. He says, I am the great mighty poo and I'm going to throw my shit at you. That camera angle is so good. We got the red book, uh, we got the first aid box, baby. I don't think there's anything else here. I know there's obviously the pool puzzle, which I'm going to try and avoid. <coughs> Excuse the fuck me. I'm hoping I don't need to do that. saying that there's nothing behind it apart from the obviously the bees and the map gallery galleria no that wasn't part of our deal but it's not necessary to destroy stars this is boof <laughs> no one uses that sound alert. I love that sound alert. <laughs> Fuck this. Jill. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's going no. on with you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm all right. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. All right, bye. Barry, Baza, Bazmeister, so Bazalo, the Bazman, Barry Manilow, Barry and Paul. Then finish one of my training modules. Hey, number 26 to go. Oh, goodness. Gonna go to bed now? No worries. We will be uh, probably uh, finishing up stream very soon. But just take a look at this. Oh, my God. I might be wearing my uh, Barry. So Fivish. Phoebe. I thought you were better than that. I am shooketh. I am shooketh. I can't believe she's done this to me. How dare you, Vivi? I thought I thought you were a better person than that. I can't believe you've made me do this. Ah! Ah! <laughs> How could you? I'm very upset right now. You yes, use your points. Good. Good. 
I hope you got none left. <laughs> Think about what you've done. <laughs> I can't believe you've done this to me. You're just a, you're just a meanie. You feel no regret. You should. You should feel all the regret. I'd never make you squeak in a high-pitched voice for three minutes. <laughs> I'm... I'm so... I, I'm, I feel betrayed. I feel betrayed. I thought you were my friend. This is something I'd expect D-Cannon to do. Can't believe you've done this. We haven't had this in a while. Have you never redeemed it, Mrs. Booth? How many points have you got, though? Have you got a lot of points? <laughs> well, then. I thought you might have a few. How are you, Vivi? Anyway, you doing okay? How's Tuesday been so far for you? Is it all restraint? <laughs> I've got some points on Vivi's channel as well. I might have to be devilish for, for Survivorish as well. The fine, okay. Well, you're playing base amazingly, so that's okay. You are surviving. And you are surviving as well. As always. Oh shit. I'm, I'm, I'm just running off ahead here without even thinking. Hang on a second. Let's let's turn around. I can't believe you did that. If anyone's not following Survivorish, please do. Absolutely wonderful, wonderful bean. One of my faves. One of the loveliest people I know. Normal voices back. That was fun. <laughs> yep. Well, Survive-ish is... Uh, I asked survive -ish on my podcast why they were called Survive-ish. And, uh, yeah, very good reason. Thank you for the hydrate. <sighs> Colonel. I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dummy thick, and the clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. My problem every day. The thick boy. Oh, the trigger warning for this, guys. Trigger warning for this. Yeah, it's sad. Um... Oh yeah, the self-defense gun. Okay. Whoa. Have a drink. Let's have a drink. Nothing in here, is it? Full of dirty water. Yeah, this is where we get the uh, key. I'm glad I came back. I had a feeling I was missing something. That could have gone very wrong. A 
Am I right? Am I right in saying, Survivor, that you've got this as a redeem on your channel to play if you hit a certain amount of points? But and the points is a lot. <laughs> I'm sure you do. No! Don't do it! No! No! Don't do it! No! 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 Don't do it! I'm afraid you. Ah! Uh, no! 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 Why did you do it? Why did you do it? Why did you do it? No! No! Oh no, the internet broke. Did you get this far? Do you know how far you got? No! <laughs> Azure, you're, you're being very generous with your bitties, my friend. Put away your bitties. Can someone exclamation mark bits for me? And give a message to Azure Dragoon. Didn't get very far. You don't like the tank controls, do you? Oh, I'll do it then. There you go. Message for you. Put away those fiery bits. Put away. Do 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 Put away Right We got some sharky sharks Watch out for those sharky sharks Oh no, your vape, not the vape. Ow. Run away, run away. Run away, run away. Right, okay, JB, this time, don't fuck this up like you did with Chris, yeah? Good lad. Okay, so. Right, so is it this one? No, no, it's not this one. Emergency! Emergency! Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Emergency! Emergency! Reaching 30% of pressure threshold. You also have a few skills flavors. Oh, nice. Oh shit. Activate emergency drainage system immediately. Reaching 70% of pressure threshold. There we go. Now you want to eat a watermelon? A watermelon? Water. 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 Emergency. Emergency. Oh, I need to release the water, don't I? 
Hold on, JB. The water has been completely drained. The water has gone. There was no water left. Um, the magnum bullets, something like that here. Might as well do this bit first. Whoops. Okie dokie. Get out of here. Anyone want some fish and chips? There we go, we got the residence key. Do you reckon it's uh where, do you reckon it unlock a door where all the evil residents are? Yeah, we're going to be probably, as soon as we get to the next save point, friends, we're going to be calling it there. But it's been a fun stream. Thanks so much for joining us. We have gone a little bit further than I thought, actually. I uh, I thought we were behind on our playthrough. And that we've, I feel like we've caught up nicely, though. We need it at the end of the guardhouse. That, that sets up nicely to hopefully finish this next week. That's been an amazing stream. Oh, Max, thank you so much. Thanks for hanging out for, for the whole stream, my friend. The whole time. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum. A duck walked up to a lemonade stand And he said to the man running the stand Hey, bump, 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 got any grapes? I thought I told you to put away those fiery biddies. Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle. That was a weird ending. Oh, we use more biddies. But wait, there's more. You've waddled once, yes. What about a second waddle? I knew we were gonna get. Oh, you are blocking me! What a prick face! What a penis! Okay, right, we're gonna end the stream here. But we should, uh, this should be enough. We should be able to finish this uh, stream next week. And that'll be the end of the Resident Evil 1 remake series, if we do. Unless we play more. But I, I don't know, I, I kind of want to play Resident Evil 1 OG. No damage runs. That's we're going to be practicing Resident Evil One. No damage runs, as in the original. This is the remake, obviously. The original 1996. Babe, wait! Babe, wait! Babe, wait! Babe, 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 wait! Babe, no! Babe, no! Babe, no! Babe! Thank you. I'm gonna grab me a grenade launcher actually for this bit as well, for this next section. 
Okay. But yeah, we should hopefully finish this next week. And if we do, we are very likely to start Resident Evil 1 original no damage runs the week after. I've not been practicing. I've not been watching. I've not been doing anything to, in terms of Resident Evil 1 OG no damage when practicing. But we're going to be attempting it over time. Wish me luck. Not even emotional damage. Absolutely not. Definitely no emotional damage. But anyway, that is obviously probably two weeks from now. Next week, we'll be hopefully finishing this. We'll hopefully be finishing Jill Hard Mode next uh, Monday. So, um, yeah. That's, we're, not, we're not at the end yet. Not at the end yet. Oh, no, no. But, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, thanks for, uh, thanks for joining us. It's been fun. I've had, a, I've had a good time. I've had a good time playing this. And I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed it as well. Uh, let's go and flip over to this screen.